Hey, what's up, everybody? It's Manlaw. We're, uh, you know, still the company driver, but, you know, that's what it takes to get where we're going. So, uh, we got a load going to Empora, Kansas. That's what I'm going to call it. We'll pull it up uh, so you guys can see. Emporia. I'm guessing that's how it is going to UPS. So, we got a load. It's, it's, our, it's our biggest load that we've hauled so far, or that we will haul. This is a total of 363 miles. So buckle up, you know, and let's get to it, man. We're trying to get our own truck and we're on our way. We might possibly be able to get the load, or sorry, the load. Once this load's done, we might possibly be able to buy our truck. So you know what? Let's do it. Let's do it. Start this bad boy up. Okay. Sounds good. Sounds good check her out check her out put our four ways on our flasher looking good all the lights work good fifth wheel secure no leaks under the truck all the air tire or air pressures uh, adequate so we're looking good man it's truck trailer sealed so with, with no further ado let's roll now we ain't got no GPS so you know, I'm gonna use my phone, is what I call it. So we'll, we'll use this to get us rolling. I know we're gonna go south, obviously, but I don't know everywhere we're going. So I'm gonna use my phone for a minute. Bear with me, you guys. But we're rolling out of here. I like this international, honestly, I like it a lot. It's got a shorter wheelbase, but you know, still, still has that truck feel to it. Wheelbase is it's pretty short. Let's get an outside view of this. Not looking bad at all. We're just want to make sure we bend this bend this corner just right. So there we go. Clear that post. Appreciate the freight, man. Keep it up. Look at that. Okay, we're off. We're gonna clear that. We cleared it. Let's get back inside the cab now. That's my brand new drone feature I call it you know oh, it's nice to have a drone handy all right we're out of here Speeding, we're speeding, better slow down. There we go. Can't afford to get any tickets. I haven't got a ticket yet. We better not get a ticket running this light. That's a big intersection. All right, looks like we're just gonna keep traveling this direction for a little bit longer. And I'm assuming it's never good to assume, but I'm gonna do it, guys. Um, I'm assuming that we're going to head south on 35 because how else would we go right so let's get her done now we're really really close to getting a truck guys very close it didn't take as long as i thought it would be you know as long as we stay active and the the bank sees our work history um you know it's very possible so Trying to make this light speed limit 35 yet? Nope, 25. Oh well, we're gonna get her across here. I don't even know how much weight we have in the box. Uh, let's look. 29,000. Okay, so we got a decent, we got decent weight. That's okay. Alrighty, we're gonna take our take our time and do it right. but we made it. All right, so I'm gonna take our time and do it right. All right, we're gonna get rid of our phone. And this, this should be three lane, that's not even safe. That's not even safe. I think it ain't rush hour, otherwise we might've hurt somebody. All right, we're rolling, guys. We are rolling. I'm going to throw our uh, our cameras up here. 
right there. We've got our cameras up from here, so put our cameras up and kind of, you know, we got to keep looking side to side. Beautiful. This right here, I ain't, this looks like some stuff you would see in Michigan. All these trees, there ain't trees like that around here. These, these guys are full of me. But it's where we were in Iowa. I don't know. Let, let's see. Hold on. Where are we leaving? Let's just take a look. So I'm I'm being accurate. And we're leaving Des Moines. What the heck? So we're gonna go. Th we're gonna run 35 South. We're, we're taking 35 South the whole way. So okay. Hey, let's do it. Let's do it. So how are you guys enjoying the uh, the channel so far? I gotta say I'm enjoying it. It's a it's a learning curve for me, but uh. It's fun uh, doing the uh, the realistic aspect of this actually makes me want to play the, do this more so it's uh, it's fun for me and you know I'm learning a lot so it just makes me want to run more loads I'll tell you that much the speed limit should be 70 so you guys know oh, 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 shoot hit the wrong hit the wrong uh, pull the wrong lever just gear down Hopefully we didn't lose any of our load in this trailer now. Gotta be a professional driver, man. Gotta be professional. Only thing that's gonna not be cool about getting our own truck, right, uh, is, uh, you know, we won't be able to slip seat like we've been doing. We've been driving some different trucks, and I've been enjoying it. Seriously. Put that cruise on 74. There we go. We're, cru we're on cruise control now, so... Um, yeah, I, I like I like driving the different trucks, honestly. Uh, but one thing that I'll, I'll like more about having my own truck is uh, not having to readjust the mirrors every five seconds or, or just deal with it, you know what I mean? It's been kind of tough back. And, and then also these trucks have different uh, wheelbases, which is obvious. So, uh, it, you know, you, we'll get acclimated to the same thing and, you know, perfect how to drive that vehicle, so. Look at that. We got rolling good, and it's time to hit the brake. Already. Got Dayton Freight in the way. They're, they're, the little boys run about 70, so it shouldn't hurt us too bad. I'm going to slow down, though. All right. I think we'll gear down to... Okay, we got construction going, so I'm really going to back off now. Because I don't, you know... I don't know what's ahead of us. Okay, 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 okay. Mm, 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 mm. Oh, come on. Okay, we're at, we're at a dead stop now. That's what I get for following too close. That was my fault, guys. Come on, let me over, driver. Let me over, driver. Let me over, driver. Huh? You know what? I can get a ticket on that, I don't think. Let me look. Nope. Good. All right, we're rolling again. Let's try this again. What kind of truck do you think we'll get, man? I have no idea. Um, I mean, there's only so many trucks out there, right? And then we're not qualified to get every truck anyways because we don't have the experience to acquire it, you know, nor the credit. So, but as long as we are consistent, you know, all that will come. Oh, okay, we've got a car on our side. Pass us up, we're clear. We're getting over. Get past this shell truck for sure, y'all. Alright, about 74 is what I want. There we go. Alright, we're in Missouri. Not not bad. Show me state. Yeah, this time we're definitely gonna get past Dayton because holy cow, that boy didn't know what the hell he was doing. You know? 
blind leading the blind and this car was rolling at a consistent good speed and now look at now we're gaining on him but you know at least he's he's slacking off in the right lane That sky looks pretty realistic. It looks beautiful. Seems like just a nice, nice day out here to be driving. Hopefully we don't run into any construction. Hopefully no accidents. We'll see though, you guys. A little bumpy. We're gaining on them though, gradually. Kind of liking this uh, this international. Honestly, I wouldn't I wouldn't mind this being uh being the being the first truck. You know, I really wouldn't mind it one bit at all. Um, as long as I can put like a Garmin in here and have have the GPS up at all times. No matter what GPS I use, though, I always keep an Atlas on me. Gotta have that that uh, that road atlas. So and you can get them at your, uh, your truck stops. Uh, you can get them uh, Amazon. You know, you can get them. But if you're out here in these trucks, get you an Atlas, okay? Because and and then also another good thing that uh, I do, and you should do as well, is uh, you know when you're in these new states, if they're new to you, um, or even if they're not new to you, just you know grab a grab a a, a state map. So you know that's that, that's updated constantly. So, you know, there's no, no worse feeling than being behind the wheel of something like this, you know, and you're, you're a professional at that point, right? So, you know, let's, just, let, let's know what we're doing. These trucks don't move that quick, you know, and they, and they can't go everywhere. It's our job to, to, to get them where they need, need to be at. And it's our job to do it safely, you know, and professionally. So let's just, uh, you know, be careful and mindful, you know, but, you know, get our job done, so... Yeah, I, I get those maps and all that stuff, but GPS is nice. I will admit that. GPS is wonderful. But do I rely on it wholeheartedly? Hell no. I'm gonna put our park lights on. It seems like it's getting dark in here already. You see the time 7:49 on the uh, on the radio. So. I'm guessing it's 7:49 in the evening. I don't know. Might, we might be driving at nighttime, y'all. So we're in Missouri, and we, uh, we're going to go over to Kansas. Is what we're. That's where we're going to end up going. So that's where. That, that's our destination. It's a pretty good drive, though. Honestly. But like I said, this is this is a good, really cool, big episode. So I said that because we're going to get our own truck. I'm pretty confident we're getting our truck. Don't hold me to it, because I could be wrong. But I'm pretty confident we're going to get our truck. We're going to get this load delivered. We're going to look at our bank. I know we have a garage uh, in Iowa, so um, we are going to be in Kansas when we deliver this load. So if we're able, time to gear down. Time to put on that Jake. We stayed 35 the whole time. I seen everybody's brakes come on, so you guys already know. I done had a couple run-ins that were kind of ugly. Taking this turn a little quick, but we're going uphill, so it should slow us down. There we go. Gear down again. Oh, we got some rain. have a chance to get over to over this truck rolls a little bit never want to put your wipers on right when the rain begins those of you that have been driving already know this but you don't want to do that you want to let that that water saturate that windshield because all the guts that you're going to that you're going to swipe across man is not worth it then you really won't be able to see so Let's 
see how that windshield is getting nice and saturated. But as you're as you're moving though, look at that. It's moving too. So you can kind of see anyways. We'll, we'll definitely get these wipers on here in a minute. We're just gonna make sure all the bugs are off. Or a good portion of them are off. We're getting over, we're gonna gear down, get over. Alright, let's hit those wipers. There we go, that's beautiful. Oh crap, we're getting off. Okay. No Jake breaking uh, while the rain's happening. We're 145 miles out, y'all, so we're halfway there. And we're going to turn on our lights to. Some kind of incident. Back her on down. Oh, accident. Uh, get over, hug, hug that this the yellow line so they got room to work safely. Last thing they need to be worried about is us passing through, you know. This guy looks super realistic. Very realistic. Alright, we're going. 100, 120 out. Buck 20 out, so we're, we're pretty much there just about, about another hour. End game, not for us. I said, we'll roll. Take her up to 74, put that cruise on. Alright. Alright, we got the cruise on. It's time to get over again. Holy cow. Back her on down, slower on down. Take her easy here, y'all. It's raining, so who knows what's going to happen. 146 mile an hour. Speed limit calls for 65, right? So. On, when it's raining out and stuff like this, the best thing I do is I just kind of, I don't use the cruise. I knock it off if I'm using it right. And I'll just straddle the throttle, so keep the truck pushed in so so we don't you know so we're the trucks in control not not the ground all right we're rolling 335 south okay 90 miles out holy cow it might it might not be so bad you know doing like a 600 mile run honestly i mean i gotta find things to talk about now the live streams are for though, right? Eventually, I'll uh, I'll uh, get this on a live stream, depending where we're at. You know what I mean? But I don't know when this thing's gonna come to a halt and end. I don't know what the top is. So, but I mean, I mean we're gonna start out, you know, getting the truck first, because at that point in time, now now the company's established and we have one truck. Yes, we're driving that truck, but then we'll hire, you know, other drivers as we progress, so. Alright, hey, 75, okay. I'm going to put that cruise on. over 62 mile out get over here I can't tell if that's a state trooper 
acting as a pedestrian or civilian or what, but you know what? If he pulls me up three miles over, he ain't got nothing better to do, I'll tell you that right now. You know, guess what? Ain't gonna be able, ain't gonna happen because we got too much traffic in the hammer lane. I need to get over here in the right lane. Oh, that's a trooper right there. He needs to be pulling that semi over for impeding traffic. Heck no. You need, man, that's ridiculous. Walgreens, man, you're sorry. We're passing on the right lane. He needs to be pulling that guy over there. For sure. His little butt. Clearly it's been going on because everybody's passing on the right. Look at that. Okay, okay, well, we're gonna put that, uh, that Jake on. We're gonna gear down. We're gonna gear down some more. We're gonna get over here and we're getting off. We are 26 miles out. What's going on, buddy? How you doing? Yeah, we're driving. You fell asleep. here in a minute buddy oh, oh I didn't see you I had a blind spot in my mirror forgive me six gears a bit, a bit too fast to be turning in but we did it as far as the truck's not bogging out what's up son Ooh, well hold on let me finish this load you're gonna go ride on your John Deere tractor go get your tractor let me check you out let me see your tractor you gonna go get it? Don't mind my co-pilot, y'all. My co-worker here. My son loves trucks almost more than I do. It's crazy. He's only, he's only two. He's only two. See where we're going, buddy? Look at See how dark it is? Look how dark it is, man. Like another troop brother. Them boys must be working. Must be the first of the month. Or the last of the month. They're trying to make their quota or something. That last trooper could have made his quota with that dude impeding traffic, but hell no. He's just over there rolling with it. You want to sit down? Your chair is right over here, buddy. Put your chair right here on the right of me. Your Spider Man chair? Go get it. Right there. Remember? To your chair? Yes, sir. Yep, go grab it. Good job. Good job, buddy. Yeah, you can see, you can see just fine. If you got to back it up just a tad bit. There you go. Sit right beside me. See? Now it's like you're right here. Look it. See daddy's truck? You're right there. You just can't see yourself as we about go off the road. <laughs> you're going to get her down for real. Roger with him. Bogging out. Yeah, we're, you ready to make this delivery, buddy? Okay, let's make this delivery, man. Look at that. Am I doing it right? Alarico is going to drive. Hold on, buddy. Daddy's got to pull in here. I'm going to hug this left side and pull back. Right. Ooh, baby. Didn't want to do that, but I, I didn't want to mess up that trailer. Okay. You on what? Hold on. We got to go inside and check in. Are we, should we, are we going to park it? You want to park the trailer? Yeah. Okay, we're going to park it. There goes our spot right there, right? We're going to gear down to two. And let's proceed. Look at, watch. Let's park it. Do you see the spot? Is that the spot right there? We are. You're in the passenger seat right there. Or you're actually in the sleeper. Oh, man, yeah. Yeah, it's a big truck. Yeah, it's like Daddy's other truck, I know. Yeah, the big green one. Yes, sir. Mm-hmm. All right, everybody, we're pulling in here. And we're about to back up. Let, let, let me back up real quick, okay? Okay. I'll give her a whole 
lot of right wheel and kind of come out of it now. We've got to steer this trailer in here. Look on this right side, we're perfect on the right. Clear, gonna, there we go. Okay, hold on. Watch out, buddy. Oh, baby. Light, you guys. That's how I kind of know that where I'm at against that uh, that wall over here. See, you guys might think if you've never driven, you think that's a bad thing where we're at, right? But that's exactly what you want if you're not going to nail it in one shot. So watch what I do now to correct this. I'm going to put this wheel all the way to the right and pull up as I'm looking back. I'm going to look forward to seeing what room I got. Okay. So it's still not where I want it. Now we got now we gotta rely on our mirrors to show us the rest. These mirrors aren't adjusted that that good, so son. Hold on. You wanna drive it? You gotta hold on. Hold on. Let me give me this outside of you guys. I, I got stuff going on here. Okay, buddy. Hold the wheel with me. There you go. Yeah, hey, good job, dude. You turned it the right way. Now we gotta go back this way. There we go. There we go. Good job. You're, okay, okay, okay. Let's get it out of there now. Let's get it out of there. And we're, okay, okay. Straighten the wheel out. Okay, now we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna. There we go. You know what? A two-year-old just backed this truck in, guys. That's ridiculous. That's ridiculous. Give me five, buddy. Give me five. Yeah. Here, get in your chair now. You did it. Get in your chair. Yes, sir. We, we parked it. Look at it. It's done. We got it where it needed to go. See? Hold on, son. And we leveled up, too. Okay. Look at that. We're at level five. So level five, we got this We got this run done. Um, So we get to add a, another attribute to our experience, right? The cool thing about the long distance. Hold on. Give me a minute. We're going we're gonna to run. Hold on. The cool thing about the experience is, uh, look at that. So you get 25% extra experience bonus for delivery distances longer than 250 miles. So we're getting more experience just going that far. So there's no need to renew that, right? Because there's no other rewards. But let's see what we get elsewhere. So high value cargo. You get an extra 18% experience bonus for high value cargo. So it seems like you just got to level up on one of these. So fragile cargo, look at that, 22%. We're not going to worry about fuel economy, right? Although that that's not bad. That the fuel economy has the best upgrades to it, right? That, that's crazy. I think what we'll do, what is this? I don't see where it says we can upgrade more out of here. We just get different categories of hazmat. So um, I'm not... I don't know if it's worth, you know, we might just add another, we'll do another on time, I think. We'll do that. We'll be rank three for just in time delivery. Cause I don't, what I, what I don't want to do is have these long, long runs with you guys. So we'll do that. That's completed. We're sitting on $3,300 $3, now guys. Started out with 15. So we a little more than doubled our money. And it didn't take long, about six, seven loads, right? So let's see what we're able, let's see what's available, first of all. So we'll go to truck dealers. Um, there's one here in Colorado, Western Star. Uh, let's visit that dealer. Uh, so we'll, we'll select yes on that. So this is what, this is what we can afford. Like, oh, this is what we're able to get. We can get we can get a truck looking like this or a truck looking like that. Oh, wait, hold on. Let me back down here. I'm doing too much, you guys. I'm moving too fast. It says cost, it doesn't say purchase. So am I not even at a level to purchase this? Oh, maybe I can't purchase it because I don't have the funds, but I can get a loan. I believe we can get a loan for that yet. Okay, so look at so you gotta be level thirteen to purchase a truck like that. So we can purchase something like this. What is this? This truck's one hundred twenty-two thousand. 
5,700. So I'm guessing this must have more bells and whistles to it. You want some milk? Okay, we'll get you some milk in two seconds, all right, son? Because you've done an excellent job today. 150 gallon tanks. See, that's the stuff I'm looking at, you guys. Look at the look at the look at the gallons. 150 gallons, right? So that's why, I, if I was to pick a truck out of these three, it'd be this one because it, it's going to hold more fuel. Heck with the looks, right? It looks decent too. It's got that rugged look to it. it looks like a truck, a new day truck, but it looks like a truck. So, um, yeah. Um, well. I guess uh, I got some stuff to do here, so I'm going to get off. You guys be smooth.